hey guys welcome to webdev cloud and in today's video we are going to see how to create a virtual host in our apache web server so virtual is host is basically a thing where we can host more than one website or, or let's say more than one web application onto our single web server so let's get started by default we have one host present in our system and that is called localhost so if we open browser and write localhost and press enter then uh, files residing in this document root this one slash where slash triple w slash html is going to run over the browser now the purpose of creating separate virtual host is to keep a uh, configuration as well as document root and some other parameters intact from this local host so let's check this let's look at the configuration file of our default host in apache so let's open the terminal and let's go to the path slash apache2 slash let's first check the directory and files present at this location and our configuration of default host is inside this folder called sites available so let's enter into this directory and let us check here as well so basically this is the file where our uh, default host means local host configuration is there so let's check the output of this file so here is the content present in this file so this is the document root of local host so files will be picked up from this location we can change that as well of course so basically we need to create one more file like this to have another virtual host so let's just copy this file and call it myhost.con so for that cp triple zero web triple zero dash default dot com to myhost.conf so permission denied so i need to try it with sudo So this myhost.com has been created. Let's just verify that. Yes, so myhost.conf is now created. Now we need to change the parameter within this myhost.conf file in order to have another virtual host apart from the local host. We are going to open this file in VS code and change some of its parameter that is required to have another virtual host. So let's say code myhost.conf and here we are so first of all we would like to change this server name so by default server name is localhost but here we would like to change that to let's say webdev cloud and let's also change one more thing which is the document root let's say where slash triple w slash let's call it webdev cloud later we need to create this folder as well so rest of things looks fine for now so let's just save it retry as sudo so it will ask for the password again so our file is saved now let's jump back to the terminal so since we have created this myhost.com file but we did not uh, enable this so first of all we have to enable this site by the command called a2 and site and the name of the site myhost.conf okay so site has been enabled now i need to restart my apache so sudo service apache2 restart and the new changes will be reflected after restart 
so what it basically does after enabling is it will put site in this folder let's say in this folder called sites enabled so if we go into the sites enabled oops sites enabled and check there then we can see that this shortcut or let's say sim link has been created pointing out to our virtual host at this path so now our virtual host is almost created except we just have to create the folder of the new document root path so let's check what was the name of the folder it's called where slash triple w slash web dev cloud so at this path we have to create this folder so let's first go to slash where triple w slash so at this moment we are only having this html folder so let's make and check so our web dev cloud of new virtual hosts document root has been created so let's enter into the web dev cloud and create one file here let's say go hello from new virtual host and index dot html so permission denied again so let us just directly open inside the VA editor or something like that index dot html and write hello from new virtual host and let's save it let's just confirm okay index.html is there so now let us explore the new virtual host that we just created before checking out our new virtual host there is one more step which is remaining is we need to make entry of our new virtual host into the our hosts file residing inside the ads etc directory so let's just do that so slash etc slash and here we have to edit the host file and put our new virtual hosts entry there so sudo vi hosts and here we make we need to make entry of our new virtual host so 127.0.0.1 tab and here it is going to be our new virtual host so web dev cloud.com let's just save and quit this and now we can check our virtual host inside the browser so let's open one more tab and dot webdevcloud.com so here we are let me just make it big so here we can see our new virtual host is running and it is, is picking file from its own document root from this folder here and we can create as many virtual hosts as we want inside our apache web server based on our requirements so this is it for this session of virtual host we'll see you in next video till then have a nice time